our story time, and Cheryl Noddle, Sharon Noddleson, let me say that again, Sharon Noddleson is going to be having our story. So if the kids would please go around and pick up the little green flags that everybody has, um, we will get going. Hit it by those books. The 
Isn't God wonderful? I have another story. This one's about my son. He was coming home from work one day on his motorcycle, and there was a line of traffic, and he was moving really slow. So he looked out. Ah, there's no cars or trucks coming. He pulled out, and he's going down the road past all these cars, when all of a sudden, the first truck in the line was pulling a trailer. He didn't put on his directional, and he turned right in front of where my son was going. You know what happened? His motorcycle hit the tongue of that trailer, and my son went flying over the top and landed in the ditch. And you know what? He didn't have a scratch or a bruise. Do you think that was a guardian angel? I sure think so, too. So there's another text in the Bible. It's found in Psalms 91, verses 11 and 12. And that says, For he shall give his angels charge over you to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you up in their hands, lest you dash your foot against a stone. Amen. Praise God for our guardian angels. Sometimes we are protected when we don't even know it. Something could have happened, we're not even aware. But God loves us so much, he gives us each a guardian angel to keep us safe. Would you like to pray? No? Okay, let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you so much. We thank you that you love us so much that you give us each a guardian angel to keep us safe. When we don't even know maybe danger is about us. We thank you for your loving care, in Jesus' name.